Hausa na BBC ke magana akan mita 13 da mita 16 da wasu tashoshin FM a wasu kasashen Afirka ko a shafin mu na internet bbchausa.com Man sauraro Badriya Tijani Kalara wake muku sallama a cikin shirin mu na karfe 3 da yake agogon Najeriya da Niger wato bi daidai kenan agogon GMT da Ghana to a cikin shirin za ku ji Isra'ila ta sanar da bude mashigar Karam Shalon dake kudancin Gaza domin ba da damar kai kayan agaji ga wadanda yaki ya ta gayyara har haran da Rasha ke ci gaba da kai wa Ukraine ya sa fargaba da kuma za a iya samun karancin makamashi a kasar rahotanni daga jihar Zamfara na Najeriya na cewa yan bindiga sun sake kai wani hari a garin Jangebe da tare kuma da halaka mutane da dama ba dan wasu da furlla mutum ko sun laike suka shigo wannan wallahi mutum sallai mai wake gudu za kuma mu je jamhuriyar niger inda yan farahu lake damuwa kan matsalolin da ake fuskanta a rulet saboda muhakar ma adinai to kafar rahoton nan bari ibrahim yusuf muhammad ya karanto mana labaran duniya Israila ta ce ta saki bude mashigar Karam Shalom domin gudanar da ayyukan jinkai amma hukumar agaji ta majalisar dinkin duniya ta ce har yanzu babu wani agaji da ya shiga zirin Gaza a halin da ake ciki Hamas ta ce tana fafatawa da sojojin Israila a wajen birnin na Rafa dake kudancin yankin inda Israila ta ci gaba da lugudan wuta cikin dare bayan da ta karbe iko da mashigar dake kan iyaka da Masar Qatar da hadadiyar daular Larabawa dake kawance da Israila sun yi kakkausar suka kan wannan lamari talks to try to reach a new deal on a ceasefire and the return of hostages wakilin bbc yace ana ci gaba da tattaunawa dan kokarin cimma wata sabuwar yarjejeniya tsagaita wuta da kuma dawo da mutanen da akai garkuwa da su a binnin alkahira inda amurka tace tana saran cewa daftarin hamas da akai kuskurima zai iya haifar da ci gaba masu samar da makamashi a ukraine sun gargadin cewa za a iya fuskantar matsalolin wutar lantarki a duk fadin kasar bayan da rasha ta sake kai wani gagarumin harin makame masu linzami har har na cikin dare sun haya shafi bangarorin sufuri da samar da makamashi kuma a kalla tashoshin wutar lantarki guda uku ne akai wa mummunar barna President Zelensky has unflinchingly drawn parallels with his country's occupation. Wakili BBC yace shugaba Zelensky ya kwatanta halin da ake ciki yanzu da mamayar da Jamus ta wa kasar sa a yakin duniya na biyu. Yayin da shugaba Putin na Russia ke ci gaba da kirarin cewa mamayar da yawa Ukraine mataki ne na tsaro. Wata yar gogor maya a kasar Rwanda kuma mai sukar shugaba Paul Kagame ta ce tana da niyyar fafatawa da shi a zaben da zai a watan Yuli. An hana Dayan Rigwara takara a shekara ta 2017 kan wasu dalilai da wasu taka kara sun karya ba daga baya kuma an daure ta bisa laifin rashin biyan haraji da tayar da kayar baya zargin da ta ce yana da alaka da siyasa daga baya dai an wanke da yan rigwara daga tuhumar a shekara ta 2018 aka kuma sako ta daga gidan yari Mr Kagame wanda yake takarawa a siyasar Rwanda ta shekara 1994 ya lashe zaben da ya gabata da kusan kashi 99 na kuri unda aka kada da labaran na zuwa muku ne daga nan sashin Hausa na BBC Maikatan lafiya a Kenya na kokarin shawo kan barkewar cutar kwarara bayan da aka shafe makonni ana fama da mummunar ambaliyar ruwa hukumar lafiya ta duniya ta ce an samu bullar cutar a yankin gabashin kasar inda mutane 44 suka kamu da ita sama da mutane 230 ne dai suka rasa matsugunan su bayan ambaliyar ruwa da zabtarewar laka sun ma mai gidaje da tituna da kuma gadoji Shugaba William Ruto ya ayyana ranar Juma a matsayin ranar Hutu domin tunawa da wadanda suka rasa rayukan su da kuma faru wani gagara mai shirin tashin itatuwa da nufin magance matsalar sauyin yanayi. Shugaban China Xi Jinping da takwaran sa na kasar Serbia Alexander Vucic sun jaddada kikkyawar dangantakar da ke tsakanin kasashen a yayin tattaunawar da suka yi a Birnin Belgrade. Mr. Shi ya bawa yadda shugaban Sabiya ya goyi bayan ikirarin ikon da China ke da shi a kan Taiwan. 
Today, we're expecting to hear about dozens of agreements between the two countries. Wakili BBC ya chi ayo muna saren jumba tungkulde ere jenyo yi da da maaz akalin kasa shong wanda zi kare jadda da ere nki kiawad dangan teka dike za kanan sabi ya da China. Yanzu Mr. Xi Zinifi kasar hungry inda zi kare kare zi yara sa na kasa shong turei. Duga shalla barindu ni nki ananda kanan sa shong hausa na BBC. Agaida Ibrahim Yusuf Muhammad da la barindu ni yara. na sai kuma rahotanni inda zamu faro tsakanin yakin Isra'ila da Hamas Isra'ila ta ce za ta bude mashigar Kalam Shalom dake kudancin Gaza domin samun damar kai kayan agaji kwanaki hudu bayan an rufe ta saboda harharren makamar roka da Hamas ke kaiwa manyan motocin da kwan kaya dai ma kare da kayan abinci da ruwan sha da magunguna sun isa wato sun isa mashigar daga kasar Masar kamar yadda sojojin Isra'ilar suka bayyana ajiya talata majalisar dinkin duniya ta nuna damuwa kan abin da ta kira toshe mashiga biyu da tattanin ne kadai za a iya shigar da agajin ga masu tsananin bukatar taimako a Gaza karhotan da Habiba Adamu ta hada mana hakan na zuwa ne bayan da kare Isra'ila sun kwace iko da mashigin Rafa da ya hada yankin Palestinawa da kasar Masar Isra'ilar ta kai harhare cikin dare a birnin na Rafa inda ta ce dakarinta sun fara wani takaitaccen aiki a ranar litinin din da ta gabata wani babban jami'in sojin Amurka ya tabbatar da cewa kasar ta dakatar da kai wa Isra'ila a makamai a makon jiya saboda damuwar ta nuna cewa akwai yiwuwar Isra'ilar da kai wani gagarin mun hari kan birnin na Rafa makamar sun hada da bamabamai Iran LB2000 wadanda za su yi mummunan barna idan an yi amfani da su a wurin da ke da cin kusan mutane a yanzu dai Isra'ila ta aika da tawaga birnin Al-Qahira na kasar Masar don ci gaba da tattaunawa yayin da Hamas ta ce wannan ce damar karshe ta tattaunawar neman sakin mutanen da take garkuwa da su kakakin ma'aikatar wajen Amurka Mati Mila ya shaida wa yan jarida cewa Amurka na kokarin ganin an cin matsagai ta wuta This appears to be a limited operation but of course it de- the, uh, much of that depends on what comes next. They have said Kamar wani aikin soji ne ta kaitacce amma dai ya danganta da abin da zai faru nan gaba. Ina ganin sun fada karar cewa za su yi wani gagaro mun aikin soji a can. Kuma ban koye musu ba cewa ba ma son kai farmakin. Sannan a waje daya ko da yake suna da alaka muna kokarin ganin an cin mai rijijeniya wanda za ta kai ga tsagai ta wuta nan take da kuma sakin wadanda ake garkuwa da su. Wata ni bakwai kenan da Isra'ila ta fara yaki da Hamas a Gaza kuma ta ce ba za ta ci nasara ba har sai ta karbe Rafa sai dai akwai fiye da Palestina miliyan 1 dake gudun hijira a can wadanda suka tsere wa yaki a wasu wuraren mujallisar dinkin duniya da kasashen yamma sun gagadin cewa kai gagar mun farmaki zai iya janyo mummunan yanayin bukatar agaji rahotan da Habiba Adamu ta hada mana kenan to bari shirin namu kuma ya nufi Najeriya inda jami'an tsaro da na hukumar EFCC da ke yaki da rashawa suka sake yin dare mikiya a kasuwar yan canji a Abuja da wasu jihohin kasar wasu yan canjin a Abuja dai sun ce an fasa shagunan yan kasuwa an dabe kudade masu yawan gaske wadanda babu wanda ya san adadin su wani abu da ya janyo bore a kasuwar kafin daga bisani a shawo kan lamarin a jihar Kano ma dai mutane sun ce zaman dardar na karuwa ta yadda mutane da dama sun hakura da zo wato fita kasuwar ka karin bayani cikin rahotan Buhari Muhammad Fagi kasuwannin canji sun tsinci kansu cikin wani irin yanayi na rashin tabbas saboda yadda tawagar hadin guyuwa ta jami'an EFCC da yan sanda da DSS ke kai musu samame akai akai a Abuja an rika guje guje ana rufa shaguna domin tsira daga kaman kamar yadda wani da ya ga abin da ya fari ya shaida muni dan wadannan suna cikin suka haraba musu tiyagas dole ya sa suka bude office amma ya san bude suka bance suka samu akwai kudi kash saka yi ba wannan kudin kamar sun kai na kudin eh to tunda ban da suka kyar gansashen abin nan da zan fada amma dai tunda ni na san cewa kudi idan suna cikin irin wannan buhu idan naira 500 ne to naira miliyan 25 ne a cikin buhun idan kuma naira 2500 ne to naira miliyan 50 ne a cikin buhun kuma an ce sun yi buhu ya kai guda bakwai dan har mutum ya ga gaske wannan akwai wanda ma sun suma mutum biyu haka ga fito da su wannan ya fa musu ruwa a wannan lokacin shugabanni ba su komai ba gaskiya saboda haka anan aka danyi wata ya kore kore zanga zanga aka shiga cikin zon plaza a kasuwar wafa da ke Kano lamarin ya sha bamban domin kuwa an rika musu salan turuku fadan iblisai yayin kaman ma'aikatan sun rika sajiwa cikin yan kasuwa sannan daga baya suka far musu ga dai wani ganau daga kanan 
to I want to bring Yakus the magic eating the Kulin chicken in the Ungojoja Aki. A casuana. A book of Yazama to a casuan to our tabas. Cover and Jenny Akaja answer good. Yes, and so Kashika wants to Ukuzako so so Ukuzo. Was so much some good to some work. Zaka, yeah, has I shall meet no Akakama? Eh, that's your kate Latin Haka. Yanzi, I ain't Kasuari Aki. I am. Did I tell you that I love Najuna? You want to meet any Senegia? How could you tell any Gamma Puto? I said, you to I and Zinni. Like an anti Ankama and Ankama, and Kuma Magana Jankama Kaja and Zuko, Ajada, Okada, and Anaba. Then was the problem with Tom Kosa like it, because you wouldn't allow to sell me like you could. Mahama Sani Dada, she knew Sugar Bunkers were changing Tawapa, Gakuma Karam by an insa. Yazuka commanded it to Gometa, I wouldn't take a Magana Akashi, but as one I in Changi, a Bachanganya, a Kantiti, Kukuma Mutanis, you will see Changi, Babusa Idaba, Kamarira Mutan and the Skizua, Neman de Ampanida, see the Delabus in Siasa, Adanata, the Kuma, what and the city is Yago, and Sakara Master Kodis is Eda. So, but they which I don't want to know much and I'm taking Yaki, the Suba, Maba, Ways and Achanjiba. I must say, I'm Kunashua Gabani, Baka, I must say, the country are going to buy us and Abu and the ski on the Gubi. Well, I annotate. Kasan command the Kasani Bawi, Kasuara, Changi, Tokutiba, Katama, I Katam government and Sudakan Sukula, I can send me the white decay. Gaza Salmon Jami and EFCC, a Salmon Katin Timmy, and send them Jaharakanu. Wanda Kakakins, Abdullah Haruna Kia, Eta, but under Kama Mutum Asherin the Tara. Ama ba in tenta nchesu ansa ki mutu nguoma shabiyu ya nza shaba kwe ni ahanu. Kamari ya da sana wade putar tabayana. Ya che sinkama wanu mutu mda kuda da nijar da sika kai saipa dubu sitinda takwas. Se kuma wanda akakama da kutu india rupita latin. Sana wata che muta anandika sang amsa laipu kansu. Kumaza agabata da tuhumara da aike musa gaba mkutu. Ande kai iru wana nsimame apata kolda kaduna. Sede enka suwa nanuna paragaba kanyada jami anza ranki kaisi mamie chiki mpara rankaya. Sinachua kuwa na pata garma ze iye shiga iru wana inuwa ya eka ta abunda ba asanji kugani. Buhari Muhammad Pagi, BBC Hausa, Abuja, Nigeria. Tuhari anzo muna Nigeria ni inda embendiga kechiga bada gala za alu umumi ayamkuna nkarakara da sauranga rulu wa dageki pati njahar za mpara. Wada ki ari wa masu ya machi Nigeria. Embendiga risi nke hara hari agaruru wa njangie bida maada da saka jikida kumitinda kumasika akashi mutani da dama baiga yengar kuwa da wasu. Tarada kwa shi duki ya midi mbinyawa. Kara wata nzabayru Ahmad. Gumay and Pindig the Kikam Babara, okay, the Mayan Pindugu Gikira Zamani, the Rana Saka, Sumproka, Suramada, a Jarita Zampara, in the Sakasuma had been Dumuta and the Kikasuar, Sunka had in Nigeria Telata, Loki in the Kasura Tatakit in Jim the Jamaa, Sunkumara Tamutani, the Dama Kana Sukashu and Kalamiaru, a Kasuar, Wanan Ganoni, Kenya de Laman in Yaparu, Yakumachi, Sunsama, Aga Jidika Jam, and Saru Lokas and Harin. Kasuramada. Then I Sun kona mutar soja da sun kuma kuma a Kazalika, <laughs>
Kimani and Kamarigida Jinoa Sukakuni Allah, a canning Gida, the Shabu, Insha, and Lava, and Kuma, and Kuma Sama. Ganing a dot and none had a hari Sukazamur Wendery, Yasa Natun to be Bangar and Kumit in Jars and Para, in the Nakaraka, King Kuman and Suleiman Bala, it is the waiter who a mala and bai shaga. Kazali kina tura masa asa kwa nkrata kwa na gamiri la marini amadi haraka wahada wana rukutu mbaba amsa. Mazala zalonda ki adabara jaza mpara sikara ta azara taki. Inda kuje tilata maa suku ngu mahara nsu nkai hali agari mfaru daki karama hukuma muliki tamaradun. Inda suka kashi akala alma jira makranta alo shida tarini jika takari ngusu biyar. Hakazali ka mahara nsu yengar kuwa da ki maana mutuwa ashirinda biyar. Zubairo Hamad, BBC Hausa, Abuja, Nigeria. Tuenzaka karipi ukunida kwata a Nigeria de Niger. Wana nshiri ya nazwa mkunida gana nsashan hausa na BBC za kwe esararama to internet a BBC hausa dot com. Tuagaba achiki nshiri nza mjiek asar sudan ama ya nzu baramu ni pima kwa pichia Nigeria watu jamhuri ya Niger. Inda kwenye ya mpara hula arlit. Saka abaya na damuwa kama nyang alu balande yenki nki puskanta musama wada ndesika shaipi hakarama adinei. Kwenye ya ndisi mbaya na haka niya yungwa tagana wada saka ya da minister ma adinei kana rusumana abachi. Wende ya kai ziyara rgani da idu awura nda kampono nang hakarama adinei yoreni ya mki kudana da ayi konsum. Ya inda masupa patikala kikira nga kaga utama ganchi mazala. Kara hota nda chima ila isufu tahada amana. Tari bukatuda kalu bali da yenki nki huskanta ni mahimamba tuto nda hadu nguwe kungi wa infra hula saka aga watiru wa manastangu. Wande jidu minya gani yiku masa ura roko kia mwa umwa mwana nyanki da alla haya wada tada arza kia maada nai. Chiki hada ya rjoni yu nenda saka shafi chenka jira albarakatan kasada mahimu manchin saamu nkudu mwa da chiga bangu. Yonku nada ka kamfuru na hakar maada nai da ki aiki. Kude ki al Mustafa alasan na wangia agarama tina gana abunda kamfuru na iran suu kwa mina kada suu maira ki kia bugu ngaba sana saama wa yanki amasa ingaji ya suu nani kawai. Kwa mina kada suu maira ya tambe suu si abunda ya kamata si wanda suka fadi to su kuma tabi suke so kuma tabin da suke so kamar suke sun ba da gidan likita na komina gidan likita na komina kuma suka ba da saboda Allah abin da aka mana Niger shekara 50 don an ba da gidan likitan da yake kin gani babu maternity ciki babu wani radio ciki kenan an fato ni kango ne na likita aka ba da na gidan shi shine nan irin wannan abubuwa suke so ayi tayi musu tabi so kuma bai na irin barna da wannan tsari yake haifarwa tare da yankira ga gwamnati da ta dauki kokarin mataki domin kawo ƙarshen sa musamman a fanin uranium almustafa alasan ya kara da cewa ministan ya ji hankalin kamfanonin kan wasu bukatu da yace ba za ta sabo ba sun ba ta kasa sun yi mana duk abin da yake cewa kaman wannan menene yake cewa radiation sun baro ta pollution da rabul nan ma mun je mun yi hira da su abin da suke kwatantawa duk babu mai mai muhimmanci wannan ma ya kwatanta musu ya kamata su yi abun albarka ko ko sun ba da wa su yan kudare kamar miliyar fudu su ma suna rike da kudaden can suna can ba su ba talakawa ba da suka ce za su ba su akwai yangara ke wannan da suka ce za su ba su ruwa rijiya tara cikin rijiya tara da suka ba da babu mai ruwa ciki kuma wannan abubuwa su ne suke so a zan kai musu tabi kuma gaskiya minister ya kwatanta musu wannan baiwa amsa wadda ya ba mu dole ne su saka halin su Kula da hanyar tawa arle tika kamfano na hagar maada na ihi duka chi tatila sawa kuwa na kamfani. Ya baada gudu mwarka shi da chikinda rina abunde ki saamu. Ndang kula da wa na hanya. Sede kungyo yin sunu na shoku ka ngida aki amfani da kudang. Banda haka kuma anta boba tunga kasuna kudang maada na ina yanka agadas. Nda aki bumbashin deke kusambili yangu mashabir zwa shashida. Yang farar hular. Sunyi tambaya kang hanyo yin saake dao da wa na mkudadi. Suna masu jada da chi wah ba aya amfani da su ba ta hanyar da yada chi. Inda sa wakira ga minista ma aada na ihi da tabata da ka fasaaren da zi ba da da mar da wada haki ngankin chikin ga gawa. Te da za a tabata da chi wah kuda da ang sun chi ga ba da ka san chi wa a jahara aga da sudan talafa wa chi ga banta. Chwa gaida ha chima ila isufu. Tua ida maka jie ka saragana bayans oom wata nibiyar. Da ma jalisar na mwe wa kiltar gwendu mariendi wa tu Faruk Ali wa Mahama. Ya amsa lepensa indeni ma apu wa dangana da chinza repi da parwa wani tanjarida Muhammad Amina Alabira. Luka chinza bampida gwenina jem ya me mulki ta NPP. 
lamarin da ya kai ga kungiyar yan jarida ta kasa ta yi kira ga ayyan ta su kaure cewa duk wasu lamarin da suka shafi dan siyasar har siya nemi a puwa bayan ya musanta zargin cin zarafin dan jaridar kar watan da wakilin mu na gana Muhammad Fadi ai kuma na daga Accra bayan tsawon watanni biyar Faruk Aliyu Muhamma dan majalisar nan mai wakiltar gundumar Yandi ya amsa laifin sa inda kuma ne mafuwa dangane da cin zarafi da farwarin dan jaridan nan mai suna Muhammad Amina Alabira na City FM lokacin da ake gudanar da zaben fadda gwani na jam'iya mai mulki ta MPP labarin dai yayi sanadiyar da kungiyar yan jarida ta kasar Ghana ta bukaci ayyanta da su kaura cewa duk abin da ya shafi dan siyasar har sai ya nemi afuwa bayan ya musunta zargin cin zarafin dan jaridar sai dai ajiye ne a cikin wata sanarwa Aliyu Muhamma yayin dama tare da cin alwashin cewa abin da ya ru ba zai sake faruwa ba sai dai tuni wasu yan jarida a kasar ta Ghana suka fara tufa albarkacin bakin su dangane da lamarin wannan ta ku na Faruk Aliyu Muhamma amshi ne bayan kira kuma abin da ya aika tan tun a farko abin Allah wadai ne kasancewar ba wannan shine karon farko ba da za a gan dan siyasa ko wani jami'in na hukumomin tsaro ya farwa dan jarida amma da karshe kawai sai dai a fito da sanarwa na ba hakuri lokaci yayi dai kamata a ce lazimi ne idan wannan al'amarin ya sake afkuwa to ya kamata a dauma jakin nunawa ga yan baya saboda hawayyau Ahmad Sali ba mu ji komai ba da kuma wasu yan jaridan da yake suna fama da rauni na harharin da aka kai musu dangane da shi afkuwan da shi dan majalisan idan ya roka wato shi Faruku Muhammad kenan ni a nawo gani wannan afuwa da ya roka afuwa ne wani ya roka ba tsakanin shi da Allah ba saboda a lokacin da yake zarafi shi wancan dan jarida ai ya fito ya musanta wannan magana da cewa wai shi bai ci zarfin dan jarida ba wato sai dai ga manyan yan jaridu sun ja kunnin shi wata biyar sanin ya fito ya nemi afuwa ni a nawo gani bai kamata wannan afuwa a yadda da wannan afuwa ba ya kamata a ja kunnin shi in ma ya yi a ci shi tara duk da yake kasar Ghana na daga cikin kasashen Afirka da yan jarida suke samun yancin yin aiki cikin warwala ba tare da tsangoma ba sai dai a baya bayan nan ana samun yawan yadda ake tsangomar yan jaridar ko da yake yanzu kasar ta Ghana ta dan samu ta goma shi inda ta tashi daga matsayinta na 62 a cikin kasashen 80 da yan jarida suke samun walwalar aiki a shekarar da ta wuce ta 2023 zuwa matsayin 50 a wannan shekara ta 2024 din da mutane da yawa musamman masana suke kiran a baiwa yan jarida yanci da walwala musamman duba da an shiga shekarar zabe Muhammad Fahad Adam sashin Hausa na BBC daga Accra Ghana to idan muka koma Najeriya hukumar gudanar jam, jami'ar ilimi da kimiya ta fasaha ta Bami Dele Olumi Luwa wanda ke jihar Ekiti ta kori wasu dalibai mata guda biyu bisa laifin cin zarafin wata daliba cikin harabar makarantar bidiyan cin zarafin dalibar da ya karade shafukan sa da zamanta ya kuma tun zara masu amfani da shafukan inda suka kiran a gudanar da bincike kar watan da wakilin mu na Lagos ma wato Umar Shewe Aliman ya aiko mana duk da matakin da jami'ar ilimi da kimiya da faza a jihar Ikiti ta dauka commissioner yan sandan jihar Ikiti Mr. Adinira Akiwale ya bayyana cewa ya bayar da umarnin a ci gaba da gudan da bincike kan lamaran hukumomin jami'ar ilimi da kimiya da fasaha ta Bamidili Ulumi Luwa Ikiri Ikiti a jihar a wata sanarwa da ta fitar ta hannun babban jami'in hulɗa da jama'a Mr. Temitope Akibashoyi ta ce an yaye ta wani faifan bidiyo mai tayar da hankali a shafukan sa da zumunta wanda ya nuna wata Ms. Opimo Posi Precious Bolaji yar shekara 18 dalibar koyon aikin jarida da ke a ajin farko tana dukan wata daliba mai suna Ms. Gloria Ajayi ta ajin farko a tsangar koyon aikin jarida a lokacin da suke a masaukin su da bana jami'ar ba duke a wajen harabar jami'ar Hakim Bushe ya ce bisa ga tanadin dokoki da ƙa'idojin jami'ar daliban da abin ya shafa sun bayyana a gaban kwamitin ladabtarwa na dalibai a ranar litinin ya kara da cewa bisa lakari da rahotun da shawarwarin kwamitin sun kori bolaji wace ta doki dalibar da sanda bayan an same ta da laifin rakariya ƙa'idar shan rantsuwar kiyaye doka da oda a lokacin take jami'ar kakakin jami'ar ya kara da cewa Mrs. Mistura Adejuwon da Mrs. Precious Olunwaju wadanda suka dauki bidiyon kuma suka yada shi a shafukan sa da zumunta an gargade su da surika kai rahoton faro irin wannan lamari ga hukumar kula da harkokin dalibai mai makon yin gabagadi suna yada irin wannan a social media ya kara da cewa Mr. Walawale Ajewole 
dalibin da ke a aji na biyu a jami'ar a sashen koyon aikin jarida an wanke shi saboda kokarin da yayi na kulle misa ajayi a cikin daki don hana ci gaba da dokan ta bincike ya nuna a wasu lokuta ana samun yadda ake cin zarfin dalibai sakamakon yin abincewa da shiga kunyon asiri ko a sakamakon hasada kan ilimi da wani yake da shi ko take da shi an bayyana cewa irin wadannan daliban na kafa kunyon asiri da kusan dalibai kan yi kafa kafa da su Omar Shehu Eleman BBC Hausa de Lagos and Algeria to idan muka je kasar Sudan da bayan gudun hijira ne suka tsere daga sansanonin yan gudun hijira na majalisar dinkin duniya wanda ke habasha mai makwabtaka da kasar kan dalile na tsaro yan gudun hijirar da sun shaida BBC cewa suna fuskanta hara hari daga yan bindiga sansanonin da yana amhara a yankin da ke fama da rikici tun a wato Augusta Mbara ya samu ta goma shi kafasar rahoton wakilin BBC Kalki Dali Betel a cewar yan gudun hijirar da BBC ta zanta da su yau mutanen da suka tsere daga sansanonin Komaya da Olala za su iya kaiwa dubu bakwai mutane masu yawa ne suka tsere wa yakin da ake yi a Sudan a shekarar da ta wuce domin nema mafaka sai dai sun gama da karin tashin hankali a makwabciyar kasar a tsawon mutane taron da suka wuce yankin Amhara na kasar Ethiopia ya fuskanci ta hitashin hankula na kungiyoyin masu dauke da makamai mayakan sa kai na cikin kasar na fafatawa da dakaron gwamnati da marin da yasa hukumomi suka zange dukar ta baci kuma suka yanke hanyar sadarwa ta internet wadanda suka gudu daga sansanonin a yanzu ba sai inda za su ba majalisar dinkin duniya ta ce tana da masaniyar cewa yan gudun hijirar na barin sansanonin yakin da aka kwashe shekara guda ana yi a Sudan ya tilasta mutane fiye da miliyan 1 da rabi barin kasar rahotan da Habiba Adamu ta fassara kenan na Kalki Dali Beltal to kungiyar bayar da agaji ta kasa da kasa wato International Rescue Committee wato wato IRC ta ce adadin mutanen da ke fama da matsalan cin karancin abinci a kasashen Sahel da sojoji ke mulki wato Niger da Burkina Faso da kuma Mali ya karu zuwa miliyan 7500 kungiyar ta ce matsalar karancin abincin da rashin abinci mai gina jiki na ci gaba da zama babban kalubale a wannan yanki ga rahotan Amina Sahalu dan ta a yankin Sahel kadai Burkina Faso da Mali da Niger na da mutane miliyan 1500 da lamarin ya shafa inda ya karu daga mutane miliyan 5 da 1400 da ya shafa a bara hukumar ta IRC ta ce kimanin mutane miliyan 70 ne ke rayuwa a cikin kasashen uku wadanda dukkanin su ke yagi da tashitashin hankula na masu kirarin jihadi har ila yau lamarin na iya kara tabarbarewa zuwa kasashen Kamaru da Chadi da Nigeria a lokacin watan Yuni zuwa Augusta in GIRC a cikin wata sanarwa mutumin shugaban yankin yammacin Afirka na IRC Madu Diawa ya ce a yammacin Afirka Zakir Afirka matsalar karancin abinci ta kara ta azzara a cikin shekaru 5 da suka wuce ya kara da cewa matsalar yanayi na kara ta azzarar karancin abinci rashin abinci mai gina jiki da rashin tsaro tare da ingiza matasa maza da mata yin hijira a ciki da wajen yankin kasashen Burkina Faso da Mali da Niger da aka kakabawa ta kunkumin tattalin arzikin bayan juyin mulkin da aka yi a watan Yulin da ya gabata sun kori sojoji daga Faransa tsohuwar uwar gijiyar su kuma a watan Satumba sun kulle yarjejeniyar kare juna wato kawancen kasashen Sahel inda ta kara komawa ga Rasha domin samun goyen baya rahotan da Amina Sahalu dan ta 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 hada mana kenan to kafin mai sallama ga wasu sakonni da ku masu sauraro kuka aiko mana baba wa mato mai adiwa yana cewa farmakin da aka kai wa yan canji muna fatan Allah ya kawo mana daidaito al'amura a Najeriya sai kuma sani mai lange lange ya wuri dake cewa al'amarin yan canji ja zami'an tsaron Najeriya sai mu ce Allah ya kyauta sai kuma ma'azu ka biro ci gumin ka dake cewa matakin da jami'a jihar Igis ta dauka na korar dalibai kan bidiyon cin zarafiya kan yayi daidai kuma muna fatan hakan ya zama darasi ga wasu masu irin wannan hali sai kuma sakon gaddafi Hassan dake cewa matakin jami'a ikiti mataki ne da daidai ko muna fatan zai zamo izina ga wasu masu irin wannan aikata laifin to muna mara balale da dukkanin sakonnin da kuke aiko mana idan kuka je shafin mu na internet bbchausa.com mun wallafa labarai 
A cikin shafin mu na kai tsaye akwai Najeriya ta musanta zargin neman cin hanci daga kamfanin Binance sai kuma sojar kiran da za ta zama bazawara kwana biyu da auren ta a filin yaki akwai aikin ceto na fuskantar barazana a ambaliyar ruwa a Brazil kenan akwai bidiyon shawara ta ga matasa masu burin shiga gwamnati inji Khalil Nur Khalil duk suna wannan shafi namu ta masu raro duka abin da ya kasa sauka kenan a cikin shirin sai kuma misalin karfe 8:00 na dare wato da rabi mu sake dawa a shirin da rake nan a madadin awal ahmad janyo da ya hada shirin da ahmad wakili da ya hada mana sauti badriya tijani kalarawu da na gabatar nake ciya mu na lafiya daga nan bbc